Hello guys, welcome back. This is second part of uh, Cambridge Checkpoint Progression Test of Year 7, Paper 2. So, number 15. Question here. The table shows the time it takes in seconds for some students to complete a race. You see here is time and then we are given frequency. Find the mode. So, the mode is uh, like with maximum frequency. Maximum frequency is here is 10. You see 1, 10, 5, 7. So, mode is going to be 14. So, 14 second is the most occurred time. Right. Uh, find the median. So, for the median, uh, you are going to take half of the frequencies. Half of the frequencies here. Let us first add this. Uh, 1, 5, 7 plus 5, 12. It is 13, 23. So, 23 over 2 that's going to be 11.5 right so up to 10 1 10 11 11.5 will go to the next uh, time so that is going to be 15 so this is 15 seconds right now calculate the mean so for the mean we have to multiply this 13 times 1 plus 14 times 10 plus 15 times 5 plus 16 times 7 divided by 23. So, here 13 times 1, 14 times 10, 15 times 5. So, I can write here 13, 140, 15 times 75, 6 times 7, 42, it's 111. Then we add it. So, when you add this one, <coughs> We are going to get here uh, 5 plus 3, 8 plus 2, 10, 1, 2, 6, 4, 2, 6, 6, 7, 7, 14, uh, 1, it's 340. So, 340 divided by 23. So, this comes out to be 14.78, approximately 14.8. So, we can write down 14.8 as a final answer, right? Question number 16, we have a triangle here, you see, the question is reflect the shaded triangle in x-axis. So, here is our x-axis, so we are going to reflect, so that means this shape will come this side. So, you see from mirror line, you have here the uh, 3 units, I mean 3 squares up, so 3 squares down, this shape will come over here like this. So, let us use a ruler to make the straight line like this, ok. So, this is the shape after reflection along x axis. Now, rotate the shaded triangle by 90 degrees anti clockwise around the point negative 1 and 2. So, center is negative 1 and 2, this is the center, right. So, uh, from here we are going to rotate the shaded triangle so this is the shaded triangle so let me just draw it here you can use uh, do it easily with tracing paper now 90 degrees so you see this is a squared uh, cut here so 90 degrees anti-clockwise anti-clockwise is this side so it will come over here right so just take these points here then you can so we are having these end points here I'm oh, sorry, this one here. So then you can just join it. <clears throat> right? So that's how you can complete this question. Question 17. We have a number line here. You can see this is a hollow circle here and left hand side is our number. Write down the inequality represented on a number line. So this is 3, right? So that is x and 3. So but it is less than, right? So we will write down less than. But no equal sign because this point is not, circle is not shaded. So this will just be x less than 3, right? Now 18a. Uh, uh, for 18a we have here. Uh, 10.132 less than x less than 10.133 write a possible value of x so we are looking for a value uh, which is in the middle of this and this 
वन थ्री थ्री राइट सो इट्स इजी मेक इट अ थ्री डिज फोर डिजिट नंबर राइट सो वी कैन मेक हियर पुट जीरो ना यू सी टेन होल पार्ट इज सेम टेन पॉइंट वन थ्री वन थ्री सेम दिस इज ट्वेंटी एंड थर्टी सो वी विल टेक एनी नंबर इन मिडल समवेयर हियर इट मे बी टेन पॉइंट वन थ्री टू वन और इट मे बी टेन पॉइंट वन थ्री टू टू एनी नंबर अंटिल वन थ्री टू नाइन सो आई वुड राइट हियर टेन पॉइंट थ्री टू वन राइट नाउ पार्ट बी टेन फोर ओवर वन ओवर फोर एंड देर वी नीड टू लुक अ नंबर इन बिटवीन दीज टू नंबर राइट ऑन द पॉसिबल वैल्यू फॉर वाई गिव यू आंसर एज अ मिक्सड फ्रैक्शन सो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल आई विल ब्रेक दिस अप सो टेन टाइम्स फोर फोर्टी प्लस वन इज फोर्टी ओवर फोर द अदर वन इज टेन टाइम्स एट एटी एटी थ्री ओवर एट राइट सो नाउ आई विल मेक द डिनोमिनेटर सेम सो to make denominator same we will multiply here by 2 this will become 82 over 8 right so this is 82 and 83 and we are looking for a number uh, which is uh, in the middle so 82 83 we don't have any number so same way we can add this over uh, let's say we can put over here let's multiply it by 2 so that we can have a bigger range so this will become uh, 3 times 2 6 166 this is 16 and this will become 464 over 16 now you see denominator is same we have 164 and 165 we were looking number in the middle of these that will be 165 over 16 right so now we can write it as a mixed number so 165 divided by 16 this is 1 16 then 5 so it is going to be 10 5 over 16 right question 19 in a school 10 students out of 220 in grade 7 were surveyed about their favorite fruit so here are the favorite fruits find the relative frequency that the favorite fruit is an apple so apple is 3 right Out of how many? Three plus one, four. Six plus four. It is ten. So total is ten. So answer is going to be three over ten. Right? Now the peri uh, principal of the school says the survey results would be unreliable to predict uh, the favorite fruit of all the students in grade seven. Uh, explain why. You see, there are two hundred and twenty students. right and only 10 was asked so that means there are small number of group was asked small number of group was included in the survey so we can't rely upon it number 20 this shape is made of a 8 uh, 1 cm cubes draw the top view from t uh, of the grid so top view you see there is one square here and one beside on this other side so we will write here one one cube here another one is going to be here then this side we will look for this one this and this so that means it will come over here and there is one on this side so this will be here right now draw the side view of s of the grid so side view you see side view you will have three of this and two of this so that is going to be like a l shape so three here this side and two this side so this is how you are going to draw this right so that was number 20 uh, so now let's move to number 21 Twenty-one here is the diagram shows a field. We have this field here. The seeds are planted to cover the whole field. The cost of plants of the seed is two point five eight for each square meter. Uh, calculate the cost of planting. Uh, so now we have to find out first the area of this field. So this is a trapezium. So area of trapezium, we have the formula half into a plus b. Sum of parallel sides times height, half times a, a is sixty plus ninety times 
40 right so this is half times 150 times 40 so this is 20 so this is going to be 3000 meter squared now we are looking for the cost so the cost is going to be uh, like uh, dollar cost of planting is for one cost of one meter square is uh, 2.58 dollars right and cost of 3000 meter square will be how much so we'll just cross multiply so x times 1 is going to be 2.58 times 3000 right so let's multiply 258 by 3 24 5 times 3 15 plus 2 7 2 6 7 so 7 7 4 then there are three zeros one two three there are two decimal places so you will have seven seven four zero dollars so this is the final answer right now next question number 22 here we have five friends complete test scores here are the percentage scores 78 82 79 85 and 23 tick to show which is the most appropriate average to use to summarize these scores so we will have the median because we can't rely upon uh, you know, that's why the two averages are not appropriate because first thing we don't have mode there is no mode because nothing is repeated here right another thing we can't rely upon mean because mean is not representative uh, can't use mean we cannot use can't use mean because uh, there is because it uh, it will be affected it will be affected by extreme values right now number three 23 a cuboid has a length of five centimeter four centimeter and height the volume of the cuboid is 70 uh, calculate the surface area now we are given length is five centimeter width is four centimeter height is h right the volume we are given the volume the volume is 70 and you know that the volume is length times width times height that is 70 length is 5 width is 4 height we want to calculate so height is going to be 70 over 5 times 4 right and so 5 times 1 2 4 so we will have here the height is 2 times 2 7 over 2 that is 3.5 centimeters right what we are looking for the surface area for the surface area you will have to take length 2 into l times w that is 5 times 4 then plus again 2 into uh, 4 times height height is 3.5 and uh, then plus again 3 times 5.5 so just calculate add them all together so i'm getting here 103 centimeter square 103 centimeter square so that's number 23 here we have another question here uh, pattern 1 2 3 we have 3 8 15 and 24 uh, so oliver says there is a pattern in this sequence that will uh, need 99 counters to take to show that he is correct uh, if he is correct he is correct because 99 is one less than you see 99 is one less than a square number why because you see these are the square numbers there is one counter less than to become a square right oliver has 200 counters calculate how many counters he has left after the seven pattern so first pattern here is three then we have 8 15 and 24 you see this is 5 then here it is uh, 7 then 11 so next is going to be 13 so 24 plus 13 is 37 plus 13 that is going to be 40 uh, sorry this is 35 then 48 
then it will be 63. So when you add all of them, you are going to get here 196. So the remaining will be 200 minus 196, that is 4. So that's it for this video. I hope you guys understood. Let me know in the comment section. Uh, and please like, share and subscribe to the channel. Thank you so much guys for watching. See you in the next video.